Alrighty guys, so we need to talk, so let's sit in a circle. We need to talk about the video that I did earlier, talking about the Israeli pop star that said, um, that wore the um, outfit of Kanye's face with the Star of David on it, right? So you can see images of Kanye and she basically put on the star of david on kanye's necklace or chain as you guys may call it right men wear chain women wear necklace that's what i was taught no um i did a research where a few magazines said that the outfit was very much provocative and it is now many of you guys say is that it's a disrespect to kanye west because of kanye's anti-semitism no I understand that the Star of David is something that is symbolic to the Jewish people, but the Star of David, <laughs> listen, this was originated in Africa. The Star of David is coming from Africa. It is also symbolic to Rastafarians, right? So if she wanted to insult Kanye West, she would need to try something else because this is not an insult. This is a promotion. This is basically her promoting Kanye West so that she can also get some clicks and some views. I want you all to research the Star of David. It is something huge, huge, huge. The Rastas always put up, you know, a short symbol for the Star of David. Rastafarian in Jamaica, you know, we always wear that symbol. It's very important to Jamaicans. So it goes to show that Jews are really black people. It is so, it is so like irrelevant to me, this entire debate about who is Jews and who is not Jews. Because listen, as a Jamaican, I can say I'm, a, I'm, I'm Jewish because of my descendants. I grew up with you know, families who are Rastafarian, they are deeply connected to their roots. And this is something that I've always seen them wearing. I was wearing this, I was gift gifted this necklace at one point, And we know it as the Star of David. That's what we know it as. And I think I still have this necklace somewhere lying around. It is something symbolic. It is something huge, huge, huge in the black community. Um, especially amongst Rastafarian. We have the Rastafarian church here. And when you step into the church, you see the Star of David. You know, like when you go to that traditional church, you would see Jesus Christ on the cross, etc., etc. In the church of David, actually, that's what the church is, the Rastafarian churches here are named, um, Church of David. When you go to the Church of David, which is the Rastafarian church, you see the um, star of david so when i read the article it said that while she dismissed kanye's anti-semitism she respect kanye as an artist and as a star and when people said that it's an insult i'm saying oh all right i'm not saying that she did not meant it as an insult but if she did, she failed miserably because this is a symbol that belongs to the black people. We need to know our history. So how is it that they're going to use our symbols to insult us? If she turned it into something else, you know, a lotus flower, I would say that is an insult. But the star of David belongs to the black people. And that is why the black people are the true Jews. This is, this is what I was taught as a child. This, this is what I studied in religious education. And if you check Rastafarianism, you will see that it's a significant symbol amongst the people. So she could not insult Kanye West because this is Kanye's origin, the star of David. This is our roots. This is our symbol. And they took away the star of David and they replaced it with some with a different star. Guys, we have to check our history. I studied a lot of history. I studied so much that I, I, I think I studied too much. I passed my history test based on how many books that I read without even studying. This is the star of David. They cannot use it to insult us because it belongs to us. So... 
if she meant this as an insult, it's a huge fail. It's laughable because this is who we are. I remember, I want to share something with you guys. And I intended to go live, but because I'm coming down with a flu, this minute I'm hot, next minute I'm cold. I even feel as though it's COVID. I don't know. I'm even in my house and I want to go to the restaurant to get myself a meal because I don't feel like cooking. And I don't want to leave the house to infect anyone, right? But I want to tell you guys this. I remember I was going to the mall and there was a group of Rastafarian at the mall because there was this vegan restaurant there. And when I walked onto the mall and I was passing them, they called me and, I, and they said to me, we want to talk to you. And I said, okay. And they said that we look at your skin, we look at your belt because I have very hairy skin. And they said to me that you are a child of David. You are from David's tribe. There are certain features that you have that we can use to tell you that's where you are from. And we had a lengthy, healthy, informative discussion. There's too much fallacies being floating around about who belongs to what and what belongs to who. The star of David belongs to the black people. No one can use it to insult us. So I could never ever see, see this as an insult, if she, even if she meant it as an insult because I know my history. And because I know my history and everything is coming back to me, the moment that I said that Kanye was anti-Semitic and, and I'm seeing everything coming back to me. And I'm asking you guys to do your own research just the same. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay blessed. See you all next time.